Okay, getting back to political readings. Trump wants to dump hundreds of thousands of immigrants on sanctuary cities, sanctuary states. So he wants to get back at the Democrats, basically. What he's doing in doing this, after wanting to build his wall, now he's like going to the other extreme and basically going to have open borders and dump all these people on sanctuary cities. So let's take a look at how that's going to work for him. First president ever to push for open borders, basically. Stephen Miller is probably behind some of this. Um, as we all know, he's the immigration advisor, if you want to call him that. We have other words for him. <laughs> How's that going to work for you, Trump? Dumping a bunch of immigrants off. Ooh. Oh, it sends him into a juggling act. Because he's gone completely the other way from where he was. <laughs> Nobody's getting into, let's let them all in and dump them on immigration yeah, sanctuary cities. Yeah, so he's this immature messenger. <laughs> yeah, he's showing up as a page now. He's no longer a king. He's a page um, sending a new message. Look, I've got a new plan. <laughs> um, his challenge... Interesting. Um, I'm picking up, you know, this could be like who you're in bed with or it can be um, who you are negotiating with or who you have agreements with. And I do feel like it, you know, his challenge is a little bit like, you know, negotiations. Um, but what I'm really feeling on this is the love of American people for immigrants. <laughs> his challenge will be the, the outpouring of love. Um, at the root of this, he's trying to get away with it like a thief. You know, I'm going to pick up my swords and dump them all over here. Um, it's, it's a very toddler feeling card tonight. <laughs> it just feels like a toddler. I'm going to take, take my toys and, you know, play with them. And you can't play with them. I'll, I'll do it. It's my way. Um, in the recent past... You know, retreating from the wall, retreating from the wall, so he can't get his wall fine. Um, crowning the reading, a mature person compared to the immature Trump as a page sending his new message, um, a ma mature, supportive person. Um, I keep hearing Adam Schiff. Uh, Adam Schiff keeps showing up for me lately as uh, King of Cups. It's also my Putin card, but um, I, I'm feeling Adam Schiff on this for some reason, maybe because California would be impacted so much. Near future, um, give some money. Like, people would donate. Um, people would donate. Um... It is a stab in the back, but because it's a stab in the back, people will donate money to take because they love immigrants to take care of these people and to keep the families together. 
Uh, it's going to cause Trump great anxiety. <laughs> um, and guess what? He's, he's going to try to come up with a new plan. Um, the other thing I'm getting off that is that there, a plan will be hatched on how to handle um, an influx of immigrants to these cities and states. Uh, what I feel is, you know, let's see. Well, the law, the law will probably intercede <laughs> and stop him anyway. Um, the law is going to st step in. Um, you know, these people that he's trying to send on a journey to these s states, um, trying to bedevil everyone. Um, what I feel is a new plan is going to come from this, and they're going to find a way to deal with these people, and will probably um, be a very inspiring plan. Um, yeah, judgment's going to come down on him. I feel like the courts will probably stop him before he gets too far into it. Uh, but I feel like, you know, the cities that end up getting all these people, they're going to come up with a way to uh, farm some of them out to other places. Um, again, send, sending them again on a, another journey. Um, judgment's going to come down on Trump. Um Everything will be okay with the people, with the immigrants. Yeah, money people will be um, bonding and helping these sanctuary cities and sanctuary states. Money people will be helping and bonding with them and negotiating with them, like creating a plan that um, keep the families together, but farm them farm them out to other places to spread it around a little bit, so there's not so many in one place to make sure that they all have a roof over their head, um, food on to eat. A bed to sleep in and not be in a cage <laughs> keep the families together so let's see how the Democrats are gonna react to this to Trump's open borders Cause them a little anxiety, keep them up a little bit. sort of truth it'll be seen for what it is um it also shows that the democrats will be the ones in power um how are the democrats gonna react with power and authority um the challenge <laughs> regrets regrets of trump <laughs> regrets um I do feel I do feel like this is a Stephen Miller behind the scenes. Um, here's America at the root of it, um, offering a change of fortune to these immigrants. Stephen Stephen Miller over here 
you know, the smoke screen over here, like trying to hide the reason behind it, trying to, uh, you know, puff up a lot of smoke and um, delusional, you know, delusional, insane. Uh, I do feel like a judge is going to get involved eventually. Um, it will uh, make the Democrats battle weary. Um, but it's good news for these immigrants. Um, good news also for the Republicans. This could be one more thing that separates Trump from his power. This is my card is separation, divorce, splitting him out, uh, putting him at a crossroads. Um, it could be one more thing if a judge gets involved in it that, that pulls him out. It's, it's interesting, um, you know, waiting and fast, waiting and fast. So this, this tells me, you know, these are seeds that were planted by Trump and Stephen Miller, you know, we're going to plant all these people, you know, in these states and see what happens. You know, wait for the harvest. We're going to plant them all in these states. Um, it will, it will probably, uh, happen rather quickly. Um, and then justice comes down, so it goes to court. <laughs> Trump's going to be put in defense mode over that one. Yep. So, I'm not too, too worried about that then. <laughs> the cards tonight seem to have a little bit of sense of humor on that one. It's like, yeah, okay, the Democrats at least will make sure the families stay together, that the people are allowed in. Um, the people will also get their day in court. Um... Let's just ask if the Democrats are making progress on uh, getting information about the children that are still separated from their parents. Will they be able to get them reunited? I know several of you asked me to read on Kirsten Nielsen, but that's like reading on Stephen Miller. I just don't even want to get into that nasty energy, how any woman could allow children to be put in cages and separated from their parents. If I believed in hell, I'd say she's going to burn there. <laughs> I believe we create our own hell on earth um, and what we experience in the afterlife is also from what we create so the cards actually feel rather sticky now I'm trying to read on the well here's the immigrants moving around the families moving to calmer waters. Will they get reunited and sent back to their countries or sanctuary cities? Yeah, you know, it was just a horrible, horrible plan, treachery, um, hidden agendas. It was a horrible, horrible plan to separate the families. Um, the challenge is the children. At the root of this, again, the children, but the bright light of the sun illuminating the situation. The light has been shine, shown on it. Um, they've been fighting in the past over this. 
um, but there is a new information that's getting ready to come out over it. Looks like um, the Democrats are battle weary over it and, and anxious over it, um, but I do see traveling and happy homes reuniting families. So um, it feels like to me they're going to find the children and uh, get them back to their parents because most of their parents have been sent out of the country. Um, so it, it feels to me like they're going to um, send the children back to their parents, get them reunited. And then when he has his open borders, they can all come in again, right? Okay, that's it for tonight. If you like that video, please click like and subscribe. And I will see you in another video. Bye.